This is a 360 degree video. You can look around by swiping left or right across your mobile device, or click and drag with your mouse or touchpad. Farmers all over the world face a large problem that isn't going away anytime soon. That problem is how to produce more food and feed more people using less land and less resources. Canadian agriculture has been working with all different types of scientists to help rise to this challenge. One of the key branches of science being applied to this issue is called genomics. In this video, you're going to learn a lot about genomics, namely what it is and how Canadian scientists are using it to help solve some of Canadian agriculture's most significant challenges. In particular, we're visiting a dairy research centre to learn how genomics can help breed more resilient dairy cows. Ready? Let's go! Genomics is the study of genomes. A genome is a living thing's complete set of DNA, including all of its genes and how they interact with each other. Genomicists, that is, scientists who study genomics, use innovative technologies to read the DNA of organisms so they can study the structure, function, and evolution of their genomes. This information allows us to do many things, like make better medicines, clean up pollution, and breed better crops and livestock. The research we're focusing on today is looking at how to help dairy cows become more resilient against environmental stressors, like extreme heat, cold, and humidity, in Canada, weather conditions vary from coast to coast, and dairy cows can be significantly affected by the weather. Since there are dairy farms all across the country, and the weather in Canada changes depending on where you are, it's important to make sure dairy cows can maintain their health and performance, and that Canadian dairy farmers know how best to care for their cows. This is becoming even more important because of the effects of climate change. By studying how the genes that make up a cow's DNA affect their ability to deal with stress, genomics research can help us breed more resilient dairy cattle. Now we're in the nursery area of the research barn. This is where all the younger dairy animals are kept and cared for. There are calves at this facility because dairy cows need to have a calf in order to produce milk. Part of the research happening here focuses on how cow fertility and milk production are affected by the genetic makeup of the animals. Many of the female calves will grow up here and join the older cows being researched. While the calves are still young, researchers need to be able to read their DNA sequence to look for genetic differences between them. To do this, researchers take a few hairs from their tails. Don't worry, it doesn't hurt extract DNA from the cells attached to these hairs and use complex lab equipment to sequence the DNA. Agriculture in Canada isn't just about growing food for Canadians, although that's a big part of it. There are also hundreds of thousands of jobs connected to agriculture, millions of dollars in world food and commodity exports like milk and grain, and other important aspects that directly affect the economy and the way Canadians live. Ensuring that livestock like dairy cows live healthy, productive lives helps protect our food supply and our economy. Genomics research can help to increase food production, decrease losses, and improve the stability of food availability in Canada. In particular, research on how dairy cows are affected by heat, cold, and humidity can help to stabilize a cow's milk production during extreme weather events like a summer heat wave or winter vortex. This also helps farmers and dairy processors know how much milk is available for the market. When market needs are met consistently, prices of dairy and milk products remain stable and affordable for Canadians. Genomics combines biology, genetics, and computer science to provide a more comprehensive and in-depth look at the DNA of living things, in this case, dairy cattle. While milk production can be affected by other things like nutrition, care, and overall health, there are certain genes in dairy cows that control specific traits, like milk production and even how much fat is in the milk of any given cow. The genomics research happening at this facility will help dairy farmers to understand how best to keep their cows comfortable so as not to sacrifice milk production and the cow's overall health and welfare. In looking at the genomes of the dairy cows, researchers can determine which genes result in more resilient cows when it comes to stress caused by temperature swings. By breeding cows with these resilient genetic traits, 
the calves will also have those genetic traits and will already be more resilient than the previous generation of dairy cows as soon as they're born. The basis of all branches of science is to ask questions and then to find the answers to those questions with research. Some examples of questions for this research team might be, how hot or cold does a dairy cow need to get before it starts to negatively affect her milk production? Do temperature fluctuations affect some cows more than others? Why? Why don't dairy cows like to be too hot or too cold? Will humidity also affect a dairy cow's milk production? How much humidity is too much for a dairy cow? Are there links between the genes of cows and how well they deal with climate-related stress? The researchers at this facility use a variety of different tools and technologies to conduct their research and, hopefully, come to a quantifiable conclusion that answers their questions. Utilizing genomics research has helped the Canadian dairy industry breed better cows. But genomics is not just reserved for animal agriculture in Canada. Genomics continues to help crop farmers understand how extreme weather, such as drought or too much rain, affects their crop yield. Farmers and agricultural companies can also thank genomics for helping them to understand how certain crops respond to weather and what kind of genetic traits are needed for the crop to survive and thrive throughout the season, providing strong yields for the farmer and meeting the demands of the consumer market. Genomics is a vital part of the evolution of the Canadian dairy industry and Canadian agriculture in general. Thanks for coming on this tour and learning about genomics. If you're curious about other areas of genomics and want to learn even more, feel free to click on the other videos in this section.